Hi guys, I'm back minus Alexa and as you can see, I already have the laptop here and it's actually um, something we got from Lazada. So, it's supposed to be a next book. Um, next 11. We just got it. So, I'm gonna unbox it and let's see what's inside. Let's see what this item is all about. Medyo mahirap siyang buksan na. In fairness kay Lazada. Okay. So, naka-bubble wrap siya nung dumating. And, kung hira buksan. Wow, in fairness. Isirain ko na yung bubble wrap kasi ang hirap eh. Hirap siyang buksan. Okay. So, yan. And then, I'm gonna cut off this part. Kuntingin ko na lang kasi ang hirap. Makapal po ang bubble wrap niya. Okay. And then, I'm gonna go through the seal. Meron kasi yung seal dito sa likod. So, as you can see, lang ko pa siyang so yan, natanggal ko na po yung seal sa likod so this laptop is supposed to be um, a Cortana um, hindi ko alam ko nang tawag eh, pero um, it's got the edge experience to it so for those of you who are not really into Microsoft items maganda yung um, graphic unit interface niya along with um, the options that you have for it. Kasi, it's a Nextbook Flex 11. So, it's 11 inches. 11.6. It's a 2-in-1 quad-core Windows 10 tablet. Now, the good thing about this is that it can function as a laptop or as a tablet. Now, the only difference is that for most people, ang gusto kasi nila yung mga tablet-tablet lang, yung mga portable, and you have that option. You can actually detach the screen from the keyboard. Now, it, uh, according to the box, it has high resolution, 1366 by 76, uh, 768 IPS touchscreen. It's supposed to have 64 gig onboard memory with a micro SD expansion up to 64 gigs and 2 gig DDR3L system memory. Um, it's also Intel Bay Trail. And it's got a Gen 7 GPU processor. So the battery is for uh, 3.7V lithium battery or 9000 mAh. And the front camera is supposed to be 2 uh, megapixels. And the rear camera is supposed to be 2 megapixels then. Now there is Bluetooth, micro HDMI, 3-axis G sensor, and keyboard with a stand and USB port. So titignan natin kung paano siya magpa-function. I specifically requested from the shipper to make sure that there's enough charge for a review and to make sure that it's updated para hindi na ako mahihirapan pag in-unbox ko siya. Fair enough naman, um, they said it's going to work fine. So as you can see, the contents of the box is the CPE, which is the customer premise equipment, or the actual netbook. And then, bongga ng box, um, it has the manual, the warranty, and a charger. So, wala po siyang kasamang um, mouse pad or portable mouse pad for our, um, yung mga gustong may mouse. Okay? We're gonna check this out and we're going to see kung paano siya magpa-function. So, I Ay, in fairness, to be fair, okay siya. So, parang rubber type yung external um, surface niya. It says Intel inside. And then, I can see a USB port on the side. And it has the, the cam, the, ba the rear cam, and the Buttons for the volume, the power, and the Windows key button. And then, ooh, so it has the headset button and the mic option on the side. 
along with the charger. Yan. So, obviously, fresh and brand new pa talaga. So, let's see how it's going to function after 100 years. Ay, wow. May, pap may papel pa. Ay, pa. So, there. Let's see. I will press the power button on the back, that one. So, it says, next book. And it's loading. So, mama, I fast forward ko na lang kasi it will ask me to set up the laptop. And then, we'll check to see the speed and the capacity of this laptop. Okay? Okay, so we're back. Apparently, when a new item comes in, the first thing I check is the capacity. So, so far, after the update and the customization of the tablet, ito na siya ngayon. Sorry, may glare. Well, first things first, handy naman siya, hindi siya mabigat. So, after up making sure that it's updated and I've customized it to what I want, So, after updating everything and making sure that it's up to at par with what I want in terms of customizing it, what I can say is definitely the item or the laptop works its own way. Um, the user manual is very, uh, very easy to follow. And quite frankly, it's not that hard. What I like about it is that if you press this button, the one in the middle, it actually detaches the laptop. And it becomes a tablet. So, so I'm going to test to see if it can do a speed test. So we're going to do a speed test. It's connected to our Wi-Fi at home. So I'm going to check to see if it can do a speed test. To be fair, hindi ko in-expect na ganun kadali siyang gamitin. Ah, uh, speed test. Speedtest.net. And it's going to be through Okla. So, I'm gonna switch the camera over to so, so that you can see. Let's see if this can pick up Wi-Fi um, fast enough. So as you can see, my PLDT fiber connection at home is running at 30.75 megs up uh, download. And it's got 31.39% uh, upload. So not bad. Not bad. Um, for starters, I guess this laptop would work wonders for students. Um, yuppies. Um, but mainly for basic computer use for like work or school. Um, if, you're, if you've got an online job, this would also be helpful for you because it's very portable. If you are a travel blogger, that will also be good for you because you can edit your stuff um, on the way anywhere. Um, my initial downside or I guess the con that I can see is that they didn't come with um, a mouse. Some people are not really comfortable with using a touchpad like this. Um, especially if you're editing your material online. So that's it. So far, I'm good with it. I tested the charger. It's fine. The instruction is also fine. So there. That's, um, that's the next book, Flex 11, for you. So there. Thank you so much. And I hope you enjoy this item review. Hit us back for the next items that we have for review.